we propose a novel method for the computational design of 4D printed objects. In contrast to traditional 3D printing, 4D printing incorporates the concept of programming the temporal evolution into shapes using smart materials. Unfortunately, the existing 4D printing techniques lack computational design tools. So far, the state-of-the-art solutions are limited to fabricating shell-like objects that are not solid and can't be designed on a microstructural level. Our algorithm takes a source and a target shape as input. We optimize both the material distribution and the actuation forces so that the deformed shape can fit the desired target shape. Instead of explicitly optimizing the actuated forces, we prefer to rely on the median shape to facilitate the computation. We show a 4D printed Eiffel Tower object designed with our computational framework. Using sparse external forces, we deform the Eiffel Tower object toward the median shape. Then, we cool down the temperature to fix its temporary shape. Next, we unload imposed forces and the object deforms slightly to the desired target shape. Finally, we reheat the object and it recovers its source shape due to the shape recovery properties of SMP material. This example shows another 4D printed Eiffel Tower object with a different target shape. Our method generates a different material distribution and more external forces are conducted to perform the deformation. We show various 4D printing shapes designed using our approach. In this example, external loads are distributed in various regions of the human body. We applied the external forces using three passes. First, we deformed the two legs. In the next pass, we deformed the upper body. Then, the object recovered its original shape when the temperature exceeded a specific value. We demonstrate another example where the external loads are applied in several passes. We deform a smiley face to an unhappy face. Our approach can be used in designing complicated objects, like the flower model shown here. The blossomed flower closes its petals when it reaches a high temperature. Also, our approach can be used in several applications. First, we show a design for a densely packed self-actuated object. As shown in this video, the snake model consists of a sequence of assembled pieces. Each piece is optimized individually as a cuboid. Thus, all of the pieces can be compactly stored for transportation. Then, we assemble these cuboids together and deform them into the original snake shape by heating them. Now, we show an example with a promising application of a grasper design. The deformed grasper is used to grab an object in hot water. Another application is the smart key lock. The key does not fit into the lock at the beginning. After being heated and deformed, the key is inserted into the lock. Then, the reheating and cooling process lock the system. The lock can be unlocked after heating up the key again. 